Okay, I'm going to my greenhouse. Hopefully we have enough light. You see the green... Uh, the green on top, that's a shading because sometimes we get... Uh, sun is too strong, creates too much heat inside. It's more to control heat inside. Because um, too much heat inside and it's not good for tomatoes. So that's why I have that and you might have to do the same if too much direct sunlight for too many hours. Now six to eight to nine is oh see that's eight feet high cucumbers. I don't know if you can see all the little cucumbers in there. One is way, way, way above my head. You know, these are my tomato. So that's the ground, and these are at least seven feet high. Now, one of the things I wanted to mention was pruning. Now, pruning means that. With my luck, I'm not going to find what I want to find. Uh, probably not. You see there, you see a little controller of some kind? See, that's not as cute as the machine for controlling you know the water because this one's connected to a tap so you know it looks like that this is like a jungle in here uh, let's see I want to find this is an example of one you see in the main stalk and the leaf there is another tomato and this would create a full tomato plant if left to grow on its own those in about let's say five centimeters long you remove them but those are removed on indeterminate type plants how does one know the difference between determinate and undeterminate by looking on Google and by the variety name see this is the sweet baby girl you know it has little baby tomatoes it's not it's fairly young still it's got yellow flowers and uh, this one the yellow, is a determinate so on a determinate this little what you call a sucker are not removed they're just not because this is a determinate I know this because I research how do I know which tomato is which oh, it's like babies you know this is uh, this is a stupus from Czechoslovakia It's got a lot of tomatoes in it. You know, it's got a lot of flowers. In the back here, this one here, I'm looking the one stock here. And this is a wild tomato. This is a native of um, Mexico. This is a nicest candy. This one. This one, very small one, is an Arctic Plenty. Um, it's made to do well in cold temperature. This is a green grape. The tomatoes will be green on this one. It's green now, but they'll ripen green. This is a Sun Sugar. Uh, it's a yellow tomato, very sweet. This one here with these and everything, the flowers and everything. This is a sun gold, yellow flower, uh, 
the tomatoes will ripen yellow very sweet at the back it's a bloody butcher I know strange name red tomato very sweet very delicious this one here is a crim these are perfectly shaped they're small but they're perfectly shaped they will be black or dark purple very delicious tomato one of the top quality in the world at the back there is a Paul Robson that's also a top quality black tomato uh, this one here and all the green tomatoes this is a sweet million and this other one here with these tomatoes